YouTube, what it do? It's your boy, the one and only. Welcome back to the Loading Zone. All my coders, welcome back to Loading Zone. Welcome back to the program. You know what's going on. It's your first time in the Loading Zone, aka the channel. Welcome. If this is your first time you know, watching the program, welcome. Hit that like button, show that mutual respect. You already know. And let's jump into this program. Stay into the end of the program so you got a reason to subscribe, you know what I'm saying? I know culture is nowadays is, you know what I'm saying? Take more than you give. But over here, we, we do a little something different. We give mutual respect first, you know what I'm saying? Hit that like button, that mutual respect. You know what I'm saying? And then all the other respect, you gotta earn, you know what I'm saying? All the other respect is earned. Let's talk about it though today. Y'all already know what we're talking about, the program. Talk about 95% of the Western women. Now, I know some some women gonna find this disturbing. You know what I'm saying? Some women gonna find this, you know what I'm saying? Basically disturbing. You know what I'm saying? Like, basically, some women will find this shit, like, in a way, they'll be like, they'll feel some type of way about this. You know what I'm saying? But neither here nor there, this is all for the betterment of, you know what I'm saying? One, the females who actually watch this, and two, the males who watch this as well, because you start to be observant of, you know what I'm saying? The different levels there is to we to women the different levels there are to women maybe i was at high school one day i was at this meeting and my boy cash was in there me and cash was talking and uh we always have some dope conversations you know what i'm saying like next level type conversations and shit but we was talking about like basically like all right so it's gonna sound a little crazy if you don't like know anything about auras and if you don't understand anything about energy but basically we were talking about like the the pussy energy that each woman had in the room like who had the highest pussy energy and once you start to realize this you start to realize that there's different levels to women it's like there's different levels to men like each man have a different level of a power in their dick, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, they have their dick power. And the women have pussy power. Like, why do you think Drake even mentioned a line about it? It was like, that pussy got power. Somebody else said that shit too. That pussy got power. Little sweet, never sour. Then there was Tootsie. Yeah, Tootsie. But yeah, men. When, when you start to realize that there's different levels, you know what I'm saying, to females, to, to people, to everything in general, like everything has an energetic level, you know what I'm saying? So there's levels to this shit. It's like there's levels to this shit. There's levels to everything. There's levels to everything. Everything has its divine order. Order, you know what I'm saying? Everything is in divine order. Everything happens in order. There's cause and there's effect. I'm getting a little deeper into the program than need be, you know what I'm saying? So let's step back a little bit and address what we came to talk to about, what we came today to talk about. So today, I came to talk about, you know what I'm saying, Western women and how they're afraid of love. 95% of women are afraid of love. I know this because 
I talk to West women, you know. I talk to West women nowadays, nowadays. But I'm very selective of who I choose to be around, uh, especially like so called romantically, you know what I'm saying? So called, you know what I'm saying? Like dating or whatever. All those whack ass labels that y'all been using, you know what I'm saying? My wife. <laughs> It's my girlfriend. <laughs> but yeah, 95% of these women, they're afraid of love. And I know this through experience. Because I'm not saying, you know, I'm a lover boy or nothing like that. But like, I know how to, exp I know how to be, you know what I'm saying? romantic with a bitch that deserves it, you know what I'm saying, and through my experiences, like, a lot of women are, like, almost afraid of that shit, like, it's like, they like the feeling, but they don't like the devotion, it's like, they don't like being selfless almost. It's like they can't step outside of themselves. Like most of them, 95% of them. This is why I'm saying 95%. Because there is that 5%. And within that 5%, there is that 1%. You know what I'm saying? So it's like important. This is what I realized. It was important for me to be aware of what percentage of this woman. was, you know what I'm saying, devoted to finding love, devoted to keeping love, devoted to, you know what I'm saying, family, and had, like, the morals that they want to instill into their life and their children and into their family, and so on, like, these are, like, important things, these are things that, like, I realize a lot of women don't value. 95% of the women in the West don't value. It's like, we fell from grace so far. And we fell from grace so far and we don't even realize that we fell, that we're in this dark pit, in this dark place where it's like only the ones who have eyes to see, they're illuminated, you know what I'm saying? Can navigate through this shit while everybody else is just bumping into each other, trying to dance on a dance floor. You know what I'm saying? Like people are dancing and fighting each other. Like, think about that. Like, it's kind of mind blowing, you know what I'm saying? Because like, they're not aware of what's important. Like, before you can even love yourself, you know what I'm saying? Before, I mean, before you can even love your partner, you know what I'm saying? Like, you gotta love yourself. Before you can even find love, you gotta love yourself. And a lot of women think the way to go about that is, like, you know what I'm saying? You do whatever you want. Showing a man that he can't control you, he can't tell you what to do. Like, you know what I'm saying? Wearing whatever the hell you want. Like, you know what I'm saying? Acting how you want. Like, some, 95% of them, I'm gonna stop saying some dudes because, you know, numbers are precise. Numbers are important. Numbers are the universe. Everything is a code. You know, see everything is mathematically calculated. Moving forward. 95% of these women, you know what I'm saying, don't value that so. 95% of these women don't love themselves. So if they don't love themselves, how can they love someone else? And this is where, like, it needs to start. It needs to start with self-love. It needs to start with not thinking that, you know what I'm saying, shaking your ass and, you know what I'm saying, fucking whoever you want to fuck, whenever you want to fuck, just because you can. That's not loving yourself. Loving yourself is holding yourself up to a higher standard. Treating yourself better. Eating better. Creating better habits. You know what I'm saying? Creating better uh, 
thoughts in your mind, you know what I'm saying? Wearing better clothes, like improving yourself and then improving others around you too. Because once you like actually come to the understanding that, you know what I'm saying, we're all reflections of each other and the people in our life are reflections of different parts of our being that, you know what I'm saying? Different parts of our being. I'm gonna leave it to you like that. What we attract are different parts of ourselves. This is why they say we, we are reflection. You know, light attracts light. But light also attracts opposite too. Once you get to a certain like, level of vibration, like certain frequencies like will attract the exact opposite frequency. You know what I'm saying? And it'll attract the same exact frequency as well. It's it's all energy. You know what I'm saying? Everything is energy. And this is what I'm talking about. What I was talking about with that little uh, example when I was talking about me and Cash when we were in the uh, meeting when we were talking about like women's pussy colors and just energy. They have different colors, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, for instance, like, if you could see auras, you'll be able to see an aura around like that era, era, uh, area of her. Uh, root chakra, you know what I'm saying, like in her root chakra, like in that area, you'll see a color, and then also, like, it'll be on top of her, like, crown in the third area, like, it'll be connected, like, you'll see it, you'll see power, man, man got power too, we got our own power, we got our big power, but, this video right here, really, is just to, like, give y'all the awareness that you know what I'm saying like a lot of these women they really don't love themselves you know what I'm saying and being that they don't love themselves they can't really love you they can't love you so they're afraid of love they're afraid of the devotion they're afraid of what what it takes you know what I'm saying like all the effort all the the, the trials and tribulations you know what I'm saying like things you gotta do, the commitment, you know what I'm saying, like, that's what they're afraid of, they're afraid of the unknown, they're afraid of, like, if I do all this, like, what's gonna happen in the end, like, what if he leaves me, like, this is what women are afraid of, 95% of them, the ones who don't love themselves, and especially when they be like, oh, I'm not enough, he doesn't like me, like, all this, like, you know what I'm saying, like, toxic, like, self deferential shit that they be telling themselves. Like, stuff that doesn't help them. Like, and this is what I'm talking about. Like, women say they love themselves. People in general say they love themselves, but they do these things that are against what they say. Like... I'm not saying all your thoughts have to be, oh, I'm the greatest, I'm the greatest. Like, Muhammad Ali, I'm the greatest, I'm the greatest. I knock Joe Frazier off right now. Give me three rounds. He'd be down in two. Like, you know what to do. Like, I'm not talking about being Muhammad Ali. I'm not talking about that. I'm not talking about being Bruce Lee. Be like water. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about being your greatness. Whatever it is you. Like, listen to what they're saying. Of course, take what they're saying. And use it. But I'm talking about you. I'm talking about you, Mel. I'm talking about you. Like, be your greatest. Love yourself first. Love who you are and where you're at. You know what I'm saying? Because, to keep it a fact, like, that's the first step. That's the first step to self mastery, self discovery. That's the first step. Like, I don't know how to even tell you anything more than that. If you like the video, the like button. If you dislike, you already know. Suck my big toe. Leave a comment down below. Until next time, I share.